You guys, I've been procrastinating this all day long. It's literally like the middle of the day and I wanted to do this in the morning and here we are. Um, I need to clean out my closet. I just like really, really, really need to. Um, or just like my clothing in general. I have, <laughs> I'll show you like where my clothes all are. I have a closet in my office. I have this rack. And then I also have my main closet in like our bedroom. And you see, I officially realized how much clothing I actually have because, um, funny story, like a year and a half ago, go, we moved into this house and our washer and dryer did not work properly until like three months ago when we had a new one. Finally caught up on laundry that I've been trying to get caught up on since then because our washer and dryer was like, you had to dry it like four different times. You know what I mean? I've realized how much clothing I actually have and how little that clothing can fit into these spots that are in my house for it. And I'm like, you know, that's a problem because I have a spare closet. And if I can't fit my stuff into that as well, like we have an issue, right? Um, and so that's where we're at. It's on backwards. I literally just threw it on. Basically, if you see another thrift with me with a big haul, jail. Jail. She should, she's banned, especially thrifting. Like, buying retail, like, that's not my issue because I'm very conscious of, like, I need to love the thing to buy it full price. But when I'm thrifting, it gets me. And so I gotta calm down because, anyway, we're here. Um, I wanna do these every season. I think I've done them every season up until now, like, for the past few seasons at least. And so we're starting here, which most of this stuff is, like, newer. Um, items that I have not transitioned into my normal closet and stuff. So as you can see, this is my office. This is my clothing rack. It just has a little bit of shoes down there. Um, so a lot of these things I'm not going to get rid of, but like some things I love and I just don't wear. So I need to look through them and try them on. So we're going to start here just because I think it's going to be the easiest. Um, okay, wait. Really quickly before we get into the rest of the video, I wanted to thank Poshmark so much for sponsoring today's video. I'm always so excited to work with Poshmark because I literally love them since they've launched. I've been on the app. Um, if you guys don't know, I used to be a full-time Poshmark seller. I still use it. I buy. I'm like a very avid Poshmark shopper. And so I'm so excited that I get to work with them again on this video. Basically, if you have not heard of Poshmark before, it's an app where you can buy and sell like a bunch of different items. They have like clothing is their biggest in my opinion. And then they have makeup, skincare, accessories, home decor, everything that you could possibly think of. Um, you can find on Poshmark secondhand, sometimes new with tags, sometimes not. Um, I think it's like the easiest way to clean out your closet and like sell the items that you no longer want. And and that's why I've used it for so long and you can find like literally any brand that you can think of I was actually just looking on there for the Frankie shop. Um, they have free people uh, Abercrombie jeans. I've just favorited a pair of those last night Like because everyone's talking about the curve love jeans really any brand that you can think of and they're basically like 70% off of retail prices um, Which I think is just so cool. I wanted to show you guys my most recent find though on there I'm actually wearing them I'm so excited about these. Okay, now you can see them. I've been wanting a pair of like silver metallic pants for the longest time. Finally decided just to check Poshmark and I'm so glad that I did because look at these pants. I just think they're the most fun ever. I feel like they're like an elevated basic, what I'm always talking about that kind of jazzes up an outfit, but they're really comfortable. And I got them for literally like $24, I want to say, which was a lot better than a lot of the prices I was seeing on other websites. Also, I accidentally lied. They were actually only $18 that I got them for and they have a bunch more on the website I just found. If you scroll down, you can see that other listings or similar listings to what I bought from and they have a bunch of different sizes so if you guys like these pants and want to find them um, Poshmark is the place because like I said there are a bunch of different prices like 18 to 24 um, originally $54 by JM collection and so I thought I'd mention that and I'm also going to be listing a lot of these things as five dollars and three dollars so hopefully that gives you guys a lot more um, ability to purchase these things and give them a new home and a new life um, and I can't wait to see if you do end up purchasing anything make sure you tag me on Instagram I love to see how you guys style the pieces or just like are wearing them and getting them and everything. So like I said, I will link everything down below that you need to go download Poshmark. Make sure you go on there, follow me, shop my closet. And yeah, thank you again, Poshmark, for sponsoring this. I love you so much. And I love these pants. Newest favorite find ever. Like seriously ever. But let's get into the rest of the video now. I wish, I always say this during these things that I wish, you know what? I'm gonna put my hair up. Wait, okay, so here's our stuff. First of all, I have this one I need to add to this rack, you guys. Hold on. Jared surprised me with this and it just came in the mail. It's the Taylor Swift um, cardigan. Um, I believe it's, yeah, it's the red cardigan the, from the red Taylor's version. And I'm so excited because my sister got the like original folklore one and I've been jealous of it ever since. And then I was gonna buy one and saw it was going for like $400. So I was like, no. And then she was making these and I was like, oh my God, I didn't even really realize it till Jared told me. Anyway. Um, so I have to add that to this rack, but first let me like go through. I think, like I said, I'm just going to pull out things that I don't think really 
want. It's like some things it's like, okay, how many white sweaters do I need? I don't wear them that often because I'm bad with wearing white. I'm gonna go and leave this one just because it's like, I like my sweaters oversized and this one's just not as oversized. Um, and I'm going to make like a pile of definitely not. So I'm going to make a bunch of piles. I'm going to have like a donate pile, a sell pile, and then like an I'm, I'm not sure pile that we're going to try on at the end. Um, but anyway, so like certain things. Oh, oh my God. And I didn't even, I don't even think I showed you guys this. I showed it to you on eBay, like my, my eBay screenshot whenever I posted on my Instagram story, but I didn't show you when I got it and I haven't worn it yet. But this jacket is so freaking cute. I have to figure out a way to wear it. It has horses all over it. And I mean, this is just my jacket, you know? Um, I love it. So, you know, and it's like this. I love this. You guys know how excited I was to find this. But it's just like I never wear it because, first of all, it like, I don't know. It's not like the exact. Hmm. First of all, it's a little bit too cold here for like this thin of a jacket. But... I just don't feel like it goes with a lot of things that I have. It just looks, I don't know what it is about it. I think because I can't really layer under it. Um, and I'm not sure. Okay, I'm going to put it in the I'm not sure pile. That's where I get screwed with these is I make an I'm not sure pile. I shouldn't let myself do that, but I'm an enabler. Like I thought, everything in here is fine. But now we have my closet in here. But that actually has all of my summer stuff. So I'm just going to peek through there and see if there's anything. Because I think that there actually is stuff that I don't really want or care for. Let me show you how this is kind of set up here. So, so if you see this, yeah, I never painted the closet inside. <laughs> it's still purple, um, which is what this whole room was before. But anyway, so here I have all of like some of my purses and bags and stuff hanging there. Then these are some like dresses and jumpsuits and like overalls and stuff. Um, but mostly my dresses and my like things that I wear mostly in summer. And then I have like a few jackets and vests, which I need to go through as well. So I'm going to start doing that. Up here we just have like my accessory bins, like my hats, gloves, whatever. Um, and then more scarves here. But I feel like all of my accessories are good uh, because I just recently got a lot of them. This sweater, it's like gorgeous and beautiful. Um, I just don't think it's my size. I had this. This is one of the things I kept from my vintage store that I um, don't really do as much anymore. And I just, oh, I love it. Okay. Um, if it doesn't fit, I might just sell it. Hopefully, maybe one of you guys will want it because I think it's so cool. Um, this is a dress. I like this dress. This should go with my dresses. This I also think is adorable. But it's just, I think, again, too small for me. Um, we're going to try... This, I never really wear this blazer. It has a big stain on it. So, okay, she needs to put it down. I forgot I had this, and I wonder why I forgot I had this, because I know I have a lot of other trenches, but I like this one. It's just like a nice classic trench. It is a little formal looking. What's inside? Oh. The belt. It's always the belt. Hmm. I can't decide if I like this or not. Like, I like it, but it's like, I have multiple, you know? Um, so it's like, which ones do I need? I need to go through my coats that are <laughs> in my bathroom, um, actually. I haven't worn this in a minute, but I really like it. It's like from H&M. It's just this, like, cream jacket, oversized. I think I'm going to keep this. Like I said, I think it, I just haven't worn it because it was in this closet. And I thought all my summer stuff was in here, so I wasn't even checking it when I was, like, looking for stuff. If you know what I mean. So, we're going to go with this being a yes still. This is almost, like, the exact same thing as what I just tried on, but in black. And I haven't worn it, but also I did just wash it. I thrifted it probably a couple of months ago at least. And I like it. I think I like this because of the oversizedness. Like this will be nice in the spring. Just like an oversized, um, what is this called? Like denim jacket. It's almost like a jacket because it's so thin. And I think I like this still. You can see this. Yeah. Now that I'm definitely keeping. I love this. I always create outfits in my head with this red, red trench coat um, for some reason. Now this I had for like actually quite a few years and I've worn it a lot, but I just haven't been gravitating towards it that often. And it's like, is it something that I'm going to miss when I don't have it? Or will I not think about it because I have so many other things? I probably won't care. And honestly, 
The one thing I didn't like about it was the lining. And also, it's just kind of big and boxy. I think I'm going to get rid of this one. Like I said, I do like this. I've taken so many pictures in this or just, like, worn it so many times. This is going to go in the cell pile. All right, we're in my real closet now. And maybe I'll show it to you first, the condition it's in. Not terrible. Not the best. Um, but we're going to see. Oh, hello, girly girl. Okay. Okay, so this is our closet. Sorry about the lighting. These are our shoes. Um, can you tell who is more organized? This is Jared's section. This is my section. And all of my shoes go in and out between like upstairs and then like here and downstairs. So anyway, so anyway, this is also um, all of my husband's section here up until the half. And so moves on to mine, but this is just like a little <laughs> um, tour of my closet, I guess. And I think this is the section that I need to focus on going through because I don't wear like, I never pull from here. I don't know what it is, like, whether it be the spring or the summer. Maybe in the spring and the fall I do more so. Um, like, there are certain pieces that I wear, like this, and things that I want to keep. Um, however, I don't need them all. Those are, like, my shirts and my blouses and everything like that. And then over here it goes into my sweaters. And this section is also neglected because I don't notice a lot of them that are in here. Um, because it's like, oh... Oh, I could barely see this sweater if I like really try and I love this sweater and I never can ever see it So I never think to wear it and then this section is all of like my tank tops my t-shirts um, And more t-shirts like graphic tees and stuff So that section is pretty good, but I am still going to like just browse through it and stuff Sections that we need to go through my denim section This is how I store all of my denim are on these like s hooks for shower curtains And then if you can see down here is getting a little bit out of hand um, So I also need to go through these these are all of my pants my skirts um, and different things like that. I have like pants up here as well. I love pants. And this section is all of like my sweatpants and sweatshirts and stuff like that that don't fit up there. And then more like sweatshirts, crewnecks, and hoodies and stuff. And this is also super disorganized, but like my workout clothes, pajamas, which I need to go through, but probably not with you because that's boring. Um, and then like more socks and like hosiery and stuff. Um, yeah, but it's like overflowing. I cannot fit my pajamas in there because I've thrifted too many. Like certain things I just don't wear. Like, tell me why you guys. I know I was with you guys while I thrifted this and I can't believe you guys let me buy this because it's like, I thought it was so funny and I was like, oh, I'm going to wear that so much. I literally haven't worn it at all. Funny on American Idol. I like like Margarita. What's that song? I don't need this shirt. I just thought it was funny. Okay. Um, and then I have like these things and I just I'm someone who I will wear what I wear during the day like because most of the time I'm in comfy clothes in the evening and so I'll just wear that to bed um I don't change into anything and I like to be like super cozy like borderline sweating when I'm sleeping and so I buy things like this thinking oh my god breakfast at Tiffany's vibes and then I never wear it um although it's so cute I just never wear it as like pajamas I buy like these like slip dresses and I'm like oh that's gonna be so cute under a blazer or something that I never really have like anywhere to wear these um yeah but that's like for a different time like I said you guys probably don't want to see me clean out my pajamas I am going to start with just like pulling things out of here moving them over to the regular bedroom area okay I think I'm just going to start grabbing things bringing them out putting them into piles and then we're gonna try on the things that are in like my maybe pile maybe we'll see. like this so cute so fun funky I'll never wear it just because I haven't worn it I haven't even looked at it and I'm just not as into patterns as I was when I like bought this and picked it out like I'm into patterns still don't get me wrong but like I just don't see myself styling that anytime soon um this I'm going to have this shirt in until I die it's going to be in my closet it's the most basic shirt ever but I thrifted it and I love stripes and it's just like it's my most I love this shirt I don't know what it is it's like I have these two tops. This one's thrifted. I like it. Um, but this, I think, is the better version. They're both like this gingham blue and white check, if you can see. And I just see myself wearing this one more. 
Um, even though I haven't, it has some of the tags on it. But to be fair, I bought this at the end of like summer, um, going into fall. And then I didn't wear it for fall because of the colors for some reason. I'm like so weird about colors in certain seasons. Um, but I honestly I can wear this like any day. Oh no, I'm going to keep this one. Why did I take that off? Um, anyway. Okay. this I feel really guilty and that's why it's been in my closet for so long I've had this for probably like over a year and I haven't worn it just because it's like you guys know when I watch me I don't even when I dress up it's like I'm mostly wearing pants or it's gonna be like a maxi dress I don't exactly know what I was thinking when I got this um I think I just really like the pattern and it's from like misguided and to be honest and this was one purchase that I wanted for a long time because of the pattern and I was looking for like a set that was twall pattern or whatever and um then I've kept it in my closet because I didn't want to get rid of it because I felt so guilty that I didn't wear it or use it or anything. But I didn't with this, so I'm going to try it on and we're going to see if I should just keep it for another season because I think it's so cute and beautiful. I just have nowhere to wear that to. Okay. Okay, so here we have my big pile of donates or sell. I'm gonna go through that. I'm not sure what pieces I'm going to like donate or sell or whatever. Keep an eye out on my Poshmark if you guys are interested in that. All that blabbing about this set, I'm gonna try this one on first. I kind of love it. I mean, I never have tried it on with jeans and don't get me wrong, like you guys know I don't wear like a lot of craft with jeans or anything, but I do think this could be cute. Um, I'm gonna try it on with the skirt now. Like, stick it in the front of my closet and just make sure I wear it, like force myself because like it comes down to that. I'm being stubborn, right? Like, okay. Yeah. I mean, the skirt is tiered too. I feel like oh, for my birthday, maybe I can wear this for my birthday. Um, in May, which I like, I feel like this could be cute. Okay. Wait, I'm actually in love with it. I start thinking about clothes and how I'm going to get rid of them. I should just try them on. <laughs> oh wait, necessarily taking my pants off fully because I should be wearing them another thing that I was like so desperately trying to um I saw people wearing it basically fell in love with it I was, that is so cool and I think I actually tried it on in my last one of these um and and it just doesn't fit I tried to squeeze into like a large from pretty little thing like a circus in itself one of if you can see that one is a little bit loose on it but it does still have the tags on it and um, I feel like one of you guys could look so cute in that. It's like a cardigan that has um, a crisscross of like the buttons. You know, it's like an asymmetrical button down cardigan. And it's so cute. I love this color. I wanted it to fit so bad because it's like if I could find one of these that fit me, a lot of the brands don't go up to like past the size large. And when I can find that, that will be mine. Um, anyway, this is going to be on Poshmark definitely. Okay, it is garbage day, so I'm sorry if you can hear them. They're very rude. Oh, they're literally at my house right now. Hold on. And they're not rude. They're picking up my garbage. That's like a good thing, so. This top, I love this top. It has big ruffle sleeves. I wore this. I think I wore this on Jared and I's anniversary out to dinner, and I felt really pretty in it. It's like a very cute blouse or, like, top. Um, however, I already have another black button-up, and I think that... I just don't like the sleeves as much on me. I don't know. I like sleeves that like go down to my wrists. Um, and I have this one like silky black button down. And I love this one because it kind of has like flared out sleeves also. And it's silky. And I feel like I'll wear this one more. So I think I am going to one. Maybe Poshmark because this is fun. I feel like someone would like this one. Next we're going to do sweaters. I already have one on. Um, I like the sweater. I just don't like the color as much. I love the fit of it though um so i think this one i'm going to sell i don't know but cute it's a striped button up it's just a little bit too small for me it is a suede but black button down and i love this i wore this a lot um i was in a phase of like wearing button downs open with like a t-shirt or tank top under it like last fall or something and i like these for the fall but i think i have enough fall jackets now to suffice um so i gotta make cuts somewhere and i'd rather keep the jackets so workout thing don't wear it donate that's vintage merch um anyway and I found this this is my like emotional support sweater it used to be my papa's um and i can't believe i didn't know that that was in there 
think that's it for sweaters, which I didn't get rid of a single sweater besides this one that I'm wearing, which I should take it off if I'm getting rid of it. Another outfit change, but I just had this idea because I have like a red cardigan in there and I'm like, I think that I could actually wear this and I would style it if I like learned to style it. So I'm thinking of like a video of styling pieces in my closet that I never wear um, or like pieces that I almost got rid of or whatever. And I think that could be fun and maybe a challenge and like get the part two of this. It's like, okay, I'm giving you a chance in my closet to stay, but if I can't figure out how to style you, you're done. Um, and so let me know what you guys think. But I saw this in there. I was like, no, I wanted to keep that. I thought this was so cute. Um, I love this. Okay. See, like this, it's like, thing is so bad. Anyway, imagine this without the sweatshirt on under it. I just don't like it. I will never wear it. I don't know why I even got it. Um, this is cute. I think it's a little bit too small for me though. Thrifted this a while ago. Isn't that cute with the little polka dots and the sleeves? Again, it, they, I just like either short or long sleeves. Well, I like long sleeves. Um, and so I just know I'll never wear this. I love it though. Um, this, I, here's my paint shirt and I'm like, hmm, should I keep it as my paint shirt? But I know I have like eight other ones. So that might just be this. Let me try these on. And I'm like, wait, I kind of like this, but I just, will I wear it? It's like, ah, uh, I feel like I have another thing that has like a collar on it, like a sweater or a sweatshirt with that. So I'm thinking, no, and also it's very itchy. Like I just put it on and it's itchy inside. This I like, I don't like how it feels. I'm, this I like as well. What do I have? I don't know what it is with me and like sweatshirts. If I, I'm wearing a sweatshirt, I want it to be like three sizes too big because I would to be like a blanket on me. Okay, I have some jeans. I want to try them on because sometimes I just don't know when I even like when I'm in a rush, I'm like, I know I go towards pairs of jeans that I know fit me well, that are comfortable, whatever. And these are ones that I don't really touch that often. And so we're going to see. I like these, but I think they are a little bit too skinny for like my full liking enough to keep them um i just don't see myself wearing them with a lot of things um so let me try these black ones these i just i think i remember them not being as high rise as i'd like i like these ones i forgot about them to be honest i just think they're cute um they're comfortable as well yeah these are yes keeping these so these are a little too they're not as high rise as i like um, so this is a no. Okay. <laughs> These just literally don't fit. Fitting. Okay, this is last, the bottoms. Um, and this is a skirt. I like, it has this like floral pattern on it and it just doesn't go with a lot of the things that I have. So I'm gonna say, no, I don't think there are any shoes. Wait, look at you guys how much more room I have now in that section um even my sweaters i still have like room for two more which was not there before um i know that sounds stupid but but everything's looking a little bit better i love it please look at the amount of hangers can you see that that ooh, that is that itself is an accomplishment like that's only a little bit of it you guys i just took some coats that i want to try on for you that i think i'm going to get rid of they have been hiding in my spare bathroom um so yeah i like this i hate the quality of it it's from asos um and most of my asos stuff is very very great quality like this jacket right here um over here is asos and it's such beautiful quality but this is like the shittiest quality i've ever received from them and i wore it for my birthday last year and um i got drunk and spilled food wine everything all over it and so um, I need to get this cleaned. You guys know I have stained stuff most of the time because I'm very clumsy. Um, it is cute. It has a very nice color to it. Um, so I'm gonna put that in my that pile. And then I love this jacket. I've never worn it. It's like a trench coat. And I don't know. I just like when I'm in the mood to wear a trench coat, I very rarely want it to be like a statement. This one is really cute. It goes down to like there. I think I'm going to list this on Poshmark. It doesn't have the um, what is it called? The tie or anything or the belt. And I do think it's a little bit smaller for me, like, rather than how I like my red trench coats, because you guys know I like to, like, be able to stick things under them. Um, it is so beautiful, though. It's, like, this suede material. Very soft. Very soft. Um, and then this. I'm not going to try this one on, but it is super cute. It's just, like, this fleece um, button-down cardigan. I love it. I just never wear it. 
Um, I have a lot of other things that are very similar to that. I think that's like why. But um, then I have this blazer, which I think I washed this blazer and ruined it. So I don't know what to do with that. But um, this was my favorite jacket last year. And I love it. I just never wear it to be honest. Reversible with this dark green and then the rest is this and I love it so 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 much um, but I think I'm going to list that as well because every time I look at it I'm like oh that's so cute and soft I want to wear that and then I never wear it I have like my cell pile here it's very large um, and I'm proud of myself because I did this in a short amount of time um, so sorry if this is feeling rushed I just wanted to get this done before the sun goes away because um, that was my goal today and if I didn't hit it I would be very sad Okay, hi, me again, sorry. Um, before you leave, make sure you check out Poshmark down below. I'll link everything that you need to go check out the app, download it, follow me on there, check out my stuff that I posted. And thank you again to Poshmark for sponsoring. Thank you guys for watching. I love you. I hope you have the best day ever and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.